I'm gonna get right to it, man. Um, we're on the road right now. This is I Am Athlete on the go. Yes, sir. Training camp with my man Pac. Shady's gonna meet us in the next city. An official tour starts in a month. So we have some interesting questions. We're sitting here with the Triple Crown winner. The Triple Crown. What is the Triple Crown, Mr. Cooper Cup? Explain to the people what that is. Touchdowns, yards, catches, leader. A while back. All right, look. Since you don't want to talk about it, I guess you got new goals this, get, this year. Um, it's going to be hard to set the goals. You won a Super Bowl, you did. You had a triple crown. Like mentally, what what, what you trying to repeat? What's your, what's your mindset? I just want to be a better football player. Like there's uh, everyone's going to point to the accolades and try to compare things back to what you got accomplished, what people you know, told you you did. And, you know, Regardless of where, what that ends up being this, this year, I just want to be a better football player. So when I turn the film on, you know, you look at the film, you just watch film. Yeah. You know a good football player when you see one. I want to be better than I was the year before. That's, that's, I'm, I'm that's a good answer. Hey, all of you uh, younger football players or just athletes out there, this is how you put yourself in position not to get a broadcasting job after you're done because he's not going to give anything that's going to be bulletin board <laughs> material. He's not going to rock the boat. All right, I'm going to let you go here. Talk. Okay five receivers in the league. I feel like there's a lot of disrespect around your name. You talk about Triple Crown winner. Has that ever been done before? No. Triple Crown? Yeah. Oh, yes, it's been done. Okay, it's been, it's been done, done before. Been done. All right, Triple Crown. All right, can you name your top five and please put yourself in it if you believe you are top five? So go ahead. All right, so last thing on the show, I got to ask you one little silly question, all right? What's the capital of Chicago? Capital of Chicago? Well, Chicago is this city. Well, I don't know the capital. You mean the capital of C? <laughs> the letter C. You got it right. Capital, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chicago is the city. Yeah. 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 Why, yeah. why do you want to see the board again? Because I was doing some thinking over here by myself, and I was, you know, I feel like, I feel oh, like that's where it is. New top five. Yeah. To Justin Jefferson. Now, let me let me give you some yeah. space. It's a big deal. You that know, there's going to be a lot of guys out there. It's going to feel some type of way. Receivers are the most sensitive human beings on the planet. You want me to give you that other paper back so we don't post that one? No, we're definitely keeping the other one. We're going to, we're going to, <laughs> it's going to be evidence for us. Yeah. Collateral. I know Pac wants to keep the other one. Hey. So what's <laughs> your top five, bro? So top five, we got Devontae, we got JJ, we got Stephon Diggs, Jamar Chase, my guy Odell, they bring it up. You put Odell? Yep. So are y'all going to bring him back? Uh, yeah, I'm we're trying. I'm trying. You're trying? I'm trying. What is it going to take? What do you think it's going to take? I don't know. I'm not, you know, I got, I got, you know, quite a few years before I'm in the, in the, uh, you know, for the front office situation. I'll let those guys take care of their thing. So listen, I know you don't like to talk about yourself and that's what makes you great, the humility. Um, you know, but I'm going to use you as the example to talk to other athletes, younger wide receivers, you know, you exploded, I would say, into the top five. No one would have thought you would be a top five receiver. What makes you great, right? What can you pull from your game? What can we pull from your game that we can give to the younger receivers? Say, listen, if you want to be great, this is what it's going to take. Yeah, well, you know, I think most receivers in this game, most guys playing at this level, they've got something that they do better than anyone else, right? Every receiver that you just had on this list is great at something. And I don't think, I think every single one of those guys is a better athlete than I am quicker than I am, better out of their breaks than I am, like all that stuff, those guys is like the best of the best when I'm looking at this list. The thing to me that I feel like I've found a way to do is, I found a way to be smarter than people, to process things quicker, and to make things really hard on people. So like I want DBs guarding me. You've seen a DB do EDDs for, I want to make them do all their EDDs when they're guarding. I want them, they're flipping their hips, I want them to have to turn, plant, break, I want them to do all that stuff. So if you're on your, you're guarding me, I want you, you're, I'm gonna challenge your technique to be where it's supposed to be, because I know that's what's gotten me to where I am. I, I thrive on just my technique. I'm attacking a DB, and I want to make a DB. I have to go through all that stuff the same way. So I think that's the thing to me that has allowed me to overcome and where I fall short with all these guys. I love that. I mean, that's a great sound bite for all you young athletes, wide receivers. You know, I call it your bit wall. What makes you the best in the world at what you do? You know, for me, it was my size. Like, I was like, you know what? I'm gonna be stronger than most res all receivers and all DBs. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna use that every single play, every single aim, every single practice. Cooper Cup. Appreciate you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Love, bro. Love it. That's great. He won't allow me to, uh... 
show you the first one he did. I don't know if he put his self in the top five or not. I don't know if he put himself number one or not. But the dude has a lot of humility, a lot of class. He's the ultimate pro. So he took himself out the top five. 